Yeah, look at that. What do we got there, eh? What do you got there? I got some slides. Look who's back. Triplita Delivery Service. Okay, so a little update on where these two sleds have been. The 23 Polaris 9R 155 and the Skidoo Turbo 154 Expert. So the last day I was out on the Skidoo was February 21st, I believe, and today is March 19th. So I was, at, I was without that sled for almost a full month, which is pretty bad. I didn't call the dealer till a couple days after it broke to schedule it in for service, but they had a tech that was off, so they couldn't look at it right away. And then when they got to look at it, the parts they had to wait for. So what was wrong with it was the ray valve position bar and the plastic nuts kind of just wore out uh, or loosened off. So they were waiting on a plastic nut. Yep, that's all they were waiting for. Seems kind of silly, but we finally got it back and then the players uh, i didn't bring it to the dealer till four or five days ago and it was ready yesterday so really quick turnaround there and it needed a clutch but it's good to have both the sleds back today we are going to take out the players 9r since we're in the spring low snow conditions and that's where that sled is going to shine Right on the players today, but I forgot oil. Caleb's in the lot here beside us, so I, I asked for some oil. Hey. Thanks for the oil, buddy. Yeah, no problem. What, yeah. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? <laughs> <laughs> what is this? It's a collector's item. Is that a quarter? <laughs> so today we got a fresh clutch on here. Unfortunately, we still got the hole in our belly pan because that didn't come in. So we got some nice duct tape. Dallas, how do you uh, how do you feel about being the only skidoo today? Oh, excuse me? <laughs> There's one more. <laughs> yeah, I think this is the most play. I feel intimidated. <laughs> hey, are we in a group? <laughs> You're baby G now? This one's baby G. <laughs> baby G. Big, big T. Big T. So today we've got a big old group. Not sure if we're all gonna stick together yet, but if we do, it's gonna be quite the venture. We're gonna just kind of, we're gonna drag Caleb through some of the shit that we like to do. What? I'm just talking to myself on the GoPro. Oh. You were looking at me. <laughs> I was I was talking about you. <laughs> This is, this is the biggest tree that I've seen in Revelstoke. 35 feet around. You can't even grasp how big it is in a picture. No. It's a big tree. Bear hug. <laughs> Think you can wrap your arms around it? <laughs> Come on, do it. Go down there. I know you want to. Yeah. <laughs> Remember? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Last time Caleb side held this section a creek, it didn't go so well. That was not what I wanted at all. I don't like videos. What's going on in there? Hydrate. Water works for the body or the sled. It's so warm today. We're riding bare hand, and then we got Caleb. What's up? <laughs> it's warm today. <laughs> We're 
the, into the enchanted forest. This is what I love about this place, man. I need gloves for this. This is dumb. <laughs> we should uh, try and continue or else we're gonna have a repeat of every other time we've been up here this year which is getting to the mountain at dark or to the top of the mountain or not even the top <laughs> Straight, we'll break through this shit in a bit, and we're just gonna be a wide open valley. Punch through that, and then we'll go up. I stopped on the top and then like slow motion. fun playing in the valleys like this it's just different from what we're used to on a normal day sure where Dallas went here. Up the creek it looks like. So about four or five years ago we tried to go up this creek. We made some snow bridges and we couldn't quite get anywhere. We made it I think just up to just up to here actually. What are you doing? 
I'm on a player, so I don't have to be scared. We made it past the sketchy part. We made it past the waterfall. So now, if we could punch up through here, it opens up quite a lot of opportunity. What you guys doing there? Canoe thing. <laughs> All right, Matt, coming up your line now. Here comes the 165 9R. <laughs> We've never been up through here. Oh yeah? No. <laughs> it's sick. Kind of steep right there. It is kind of steep right here. <laughs> I wanted to go up to that where it kind of pulls out. Oh man, I got a shovel. <laughs> What's up? Is that clear to come up? Yep. So we got the Jackson Hole pre-qualifiers here, AQ. Yeah, this is way cooler than Jackson Hole. Oh, he's got oh, it. Dollars. Come on, come on. An absolute rocket ship. Yes. Yeah, Dal, come on. Go. Give her the power. <laughs> you got it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Dal. <laughs> Next contender up we got Rigel on the boost. Oh! Oh, baby! It's not going! Uh oh! <laughs> you almost had that! Come on, Levi! Oh, no! Oh, it stopped. Those trees, just be aware of the people there, but if you make the straight shot, it's clear. Straight up. This is great. I love this. Yeah. I love being at the top. <laughs> we got our next contender. Who we got? We got Zacho. Oh. Yep, he's on the line. Yeah. They're they're gonna road build from here up to right there. I feel right at home here. <laughs> Where are you guys trying to go there? Between? Oh, between those two trees? Yeah, build a little runaway. Okay. It's like a sidewalk, Oregon Trail. Oh! Uh oh. He's sliding all the way back down. Oh, the sled is rolling. Listen for it. No, no crunch. I was waiting for it, but never came. That's a lot of rolling. I think that sled did okay. You guys really can't grasp how steep the section is right here. <laughs> if you see these slide marks, it's really amazing this sled even stopped right here. We got Levi, oh, we're getting rowdy. Come on, buddy! Oh! That's good. Hey, is that a better line? <laughs> Man, the shit we drag people through. <laughs> Sometimes I feel bad. He's losing momentum too early. He's gonna have to turn out. That shoots so much gnarlier than it looks. 
Levi made it. I missed it, but he pulled the chute. Let's go check on the road builders. One sixty five turbo is up. <laughs> we got Grayson down there. You guys can't see him, but he's going for the super shoot over here. Grayson on the 155 boost. Better get out of the way. somehow get this sled down to this road. <laughs> you know it's a steep side hill when your shoulders touching the snowbank. What's the plan there? You don't know the plan? Slide. Slide? And then it's gonna roll? Not go down there. Okay. And then maybe go this way? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 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 it's, oh, the end no maneuver, it stopped, hey, Grayson, they, they wanted, I think they wanted wanted a landing pad, you kind of picked a hard route, I think this is all on you, every fuck flood down here is because they followed you, no, that's better, <laughs> That's gotta ride that cliffed out sled. This is the unnatural. This is what I like. This is good stuff right here. Well, this is what I like. Why didn't we do this every day? I don't know. <laughs> All right. Sorry, guys, I gotta film. So if you wanna give these guys a hand. I got a Gatorade to drink here, Matt. Oh, he's good. Maybe. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> oh, perfect. <laughs> yep. One, two, three. Project like this requires yeah, a couple up, good up. form and eh, Matt? <laughs> you got it. <laughs> I got my white hat. <laughs> yeah, boys, you're doing a hell of a job, right, darling. Pull, pull it into the hill yeah. and we'll just drop the front. Just like that. Would have been on my tunnel, just as predicted. <laughs> <laughs> We're off to the races now. The top actually mellowed out a little bit. I wonder if we could get up there. Let's continue on our adventure now. See what else we can find. If we could get up through here, we could actually do one massive freaking loop. That'd be really cool. I don't think the 165 could do that. I don't think we really even have a line here. That was a group friendly line up. Yeah, I think they're gonna all stay down there. I don't even know if there's a way this way. 
I think we want to follow the gut. Up. Yeah. I don't know if we could go down from here or not. You could, you could find out. <laughs> you can find out. <laughs> I'm uh, not gonna follow Caleb this time. We're gonna go up this way. <laughs> Wonder if we could go down this. Massive log there. Wow, we got a long way down here. This is not nice. Oh. Shit. Okay, let's assess the situation here. Wow, it's a long way down. Okay. So we're in a bit of a predicament here. I shouldn't have dropped down here. I knew the creek bottom was right here, but it's really steep here. Um, straight down like 15 feet right to here. I could probably just send the sled down backwards. Not on it, obviously. And it might end up okay that way. But I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut a bench down through here to get me down to that lower level. And then from there, I'm clear. I just won't be able to descend this and stay in control because this is pretty much straight down right here. And then there's kind of a hole here and I'll definitely end up into those trees. We got Dallas. Hey, buddy! It's right behind me! <laughs> okay. The track's not in the air, so, or it will be. Three, two. <laughs> That is sick. Dude, this is still scary. Ah. Thanks for the ski pole. No worries. Spot would have been right here. I just did not see it. <laughs> but that was fun, honestly. <laughs> I know some people watch when we're going through stuff like that and they're like, why would you ever want to do that? That looks like way too much work. Is adventure ever easy? If it was easy, it wouldn't be fun. This is a big, big valley. Okay. Let's try and make some ground now. It's a cool rock. Oh, I think we're gonna 
have to go. I'm going around this one. Oh no, we got a line through the trees. danger is high that's for sure even when the avalanche danger isn't high it's still scary there's a lot of snow right here <laughs> you never want to stop in an abbey path all this stuff is already slid so gives you some peace of mind Ty and Dallas ended up way up here ahead of us, so we'll go catch up to them, see how far they made it. Oh, they're just right there. Are we gonna go up into the back or go straight? It looks inviting right there. Yeah, it does. <laughs> we got two options here. We stay straight in the valley. <laughs> or we go up into there which looks really cool but i don't we need to be able to get over the top and go back down the other side and i don't think we'll be able to from right there i know we can connect if we go this way holy smokes that's cool there's a crazy looking shoot over here that I see Dallas looking at. I know he wants to go up it. <laughs> Sweet. You could totally get above that into it and climb it. I'm like, that looks cool. Yeah, it's Dallas. <laughs> no surprise there. I wonder if he thinks he's the first one in here. He <laughs> Should we radio him and... Well, I don't think they're gonna stop, so... I guess we better catch up. <laughs> if I did chase, they're gonna be shit themselves. <laughs> they've never been in Alpine. No, the that's wild. Fail was the closest thing to Alpine they've ever did. Yeah. Dallas is just going for it. No chill at all. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
scoping out a potential route on the topple map and this is pretty much the way <laughs> we've been over there and up there because that was remember my last year when the players fuel pump went and you guys went right up top over there that was a quite the elevation gain from yeah we went from what three thousand feet to seven <laughs> Sorry, Dallas. Lunch break. Lunch break. 360 degrees around. Why do you look so happy? <laughs> I'm extra foreign, man. <laughs> You can put the drone in. Actually, maybe I will. I'll put the drone in there and see if we can yeah. get closer to the edge. Look at us up there. Yeah, you can actually go yeah, hike look out on over the there. Bridge. Amazing stuff up here. Perfect day for it. It's crazy how there's not a stitch of wind up here. Oh, there's a little breeze. We got the tropical drink for the tropical day here. <laughs> the ants are coming. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, that's something else. Watch out, she's gonna blow. She's gonna blow. <laughs> Don't kick that thing right. <laughs> Unless we're trading sides. <laughs> that was a nice little lunch stop, but. I think we're gonna try and make our loop now. Cause we still got a long way to go, depending on which way we go. If we can make the short loop, we got 25K and kind of a direct line. If we take the long route, we've got 40 kilometers on a direct line. Not a straight line, just like drawing a line on the top of the map. Don't know if we have enough fuel to do the long route. I imagine your first time being in this stuff is pretty intimidating too. It is. And like that shit, like, I mean, that's the gnarliest I've ever climbed. Yeah. a wild pull for some reason the sled was hitting max detonation halfway up i had to stop shut it off and then keep going but damn <laughs> that's some big country boys A minute 20 seconds for that pull. This is a lot for a boy from Wisconsin. <laughs> yeah, that's a pretty... That's the trail. <laughs> that's not even like a shoot we're pulling. That's just the trail up. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty gnarly. Look at this. Just an ant. Climbing this big old ant hill. What do you think of this zone, Chase? Heart. So happy. A little bigger than the UP. You know, it's Green Gate is comparable, but this might have it by just a hair. It takes about half a tank of gas to make that pull. <laughs> you think Grayson's shitting himself too? <laughs> He's so out of his comfort level. Oh yeah. <laughs> A Shafleta's don't alpine ride. <laughs> Bring me to the top! <laughs> yeah, baby! 
Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Dude. What? <laughs> Can we call a heli and get some fuel? Dude, I would. Oh. Hey, Americans. Oh my God. What do you think? This is incredible. <laughs> <laughs> now that's pretty cool. Isn't it? Okay. We could see town right here. Let's see if we can make a call. Hey there, it's uh, Matt. Um, are you guys doing any more flights this afternoon? Uh, we got a machine out and about. Uh, well, we're, we're out and about here and we could maybe uh, get a heli drop for some fuel. Do you want coordinates? Yeah, I could give you one. So, found this sick zone. Now we're gonna get some gas heli to us so we can tear it up. Do you have any preferences for pizza or just... We'll just grab uh, two large pepperonis. Yeah, that's all, thanks. Okay, not sure if you guys caught all that, but we got fuel and pizza coming out here. Probably going to be about an hour and a half yet, but what a day to do it. Glacier Helicopters is going to bring it out, and apparently it's only going to be under $600. So if there's 10 of us here, that's pretty affordable. What an awesome freaking day. Especially cool to be out here with everybody. We almost split up into two groups today But this is way better. There's a nice little jump. I got to burn some fuel though. I th think I actually have more than I think What a cool zone Some wildlife tracks oh we could drop into here and go out another way that's a good option <laughs> I forgot I was in the jump. <laughs> Big country boys. Some rock climbing. You can see our tracks from earlier. Right there. A couple of boys coming up. Hi! Why did I climb up here? I want to come up. I'm scared to come down. I want to make friendship. Looking at a jump up here. Not sure if I'll hit it. Maybe I'll hit it. I don't know. I always feel too much pressure when the pros are jumping to take part. I'm scared to hold it just wide open, but it's totally fine on this jump. Just doing a little jump in here. Losing our sun a bit, but hopefully it's still up for 
the chopper. Caleb lining up for another hit here. Let's see. Big air. Oh, Mac. Levi's going for one more. Nice. Since it's probably going to be a pretty late night here on the mountain, our helicopter's not going to be here until 6.30. Better go give Chloe a call. Three hour time change back home. Six o'clock now, so it'll be nine o'clock at home. Hi, dear. We gotta burn some more fuel. I think we got too much. The photographer's just bossing me around here. What do you want? Okay. Wants me to look, lock eyes with them. All romantic like. Oh, you got scared! <laughs> you got the shot? That's the one I wanted. Good stuff. Nice. I'll do one more. I'll try and get more pop again. I gotta go pay for the helicopter. Four or five, perfect. All right, our heli is almost on the way. Look like Caleb's packing a jump here. Little nice little gap jump. Yeah. Concept. Yeah. So, Dallas, what are you thinking? Do you think our way out's gonna be down through here? Or are we take our original plan and take the longer way out that way? Well, I think the fast way would be nice, but I don't... Yeah, the fast way would be nice because the sun is going to set soon. But it looks pretty gnarly. It, it doesn't... Ah, it's hard to say. The only thing that concerns me is just like, just random cliff. You get going too fast and you can't stop. Random cliff. I think you'll be able to keep control down here, though. Here's the alley! <laughs> <laughs> Big day out here for the boys. Thanks, Colby. Hey, yeah, buddy. No time. Get into some pizza. She's still hot. Oh, it's still warm, eh? Pot, the pilot just loves it, eh? <laughs> he got a sick view. He was probably, I don't know if he could film and hover at the same time. We're all here enjoying some pizza. 
Caleb just wants to nail this jump as smooth as he can. He doesn't even care. It's a determination at its finest. That's looking better. Do you even jump, bro? <laughs> that knack knack. It's a lot of work. Well, no condom drinking on the mountain, but after a day like this, gotta have one for my dinner. <laughs> Satisfied? <laughs> no, but. Oh, come on. That's okay. I'm satisfied with the day. Yeah. Not satisfied with this jump. But still looks sick. It's so fun. I think we should be all right going straight down here. It doesn't look bad. Might get fast for the next guys. It's gonna be quick, but. Yeah, I don't know. If you dig a key in, you might be able to hit that spine, follow the spine. This next section is definitely a steep spot, but we could go steeper than this. Like, this is not that bad. Ah, we're golden. No problem. There's a really cool little shoot right here. Let's rip up it quick. off in that shoot. <laughs> Sorry for cutting you off. I'm like, I, I look to turn out, I'm like, oh man, I'm really screwing Caleb here. Yeah, it worked out. But... Oh, man, that? it's actually kind of fun at 7,600. <laughs> You're challenge. lying. Way more of a challenge. <laughs> yeah, we go down. No, yeah, we just came up here for fun. Well, Energizer Bunny, go, go, go. Two, yeah! <laughs> Dude, we're gonna be here a while. I have so much fuel now. <laughs> Look at that. You better get going. <laughs> <laughs> Last time Dallas and I came up here, this was such a hard hill to pull up. Now we just idle up it. Woo! The snow is grippy now. That guy looks right behind me. I know, eh? You could go probably right across there and drop right into like the main. Let's go to the top! Yeah! Woo! That peak looks cool! I thought we were gonna be heading out now. Should never refuel on 
<laughs> I'm good for another four or five hours. <laughs> I'm kind of like ready to go hit the trees again. Yeah, let's find some north facing stuff, some nice snow. I was thinking how crusty and perfect it would be in the sunnies. <laughs> There'd be so much traction. <laughs> no. Put the scratches down. No. You guys ready to go? <laughs> All right, we'll make a mile then. Oh, don't jump in the dark. You cannot see your landing. Nice wet slide avalanche came through here today. Well, not necessarily today, I guess. But it is frozen hard. Woo. Oh my God, this is a big one. Gnarly. Oh. It's like driving over rocks. It's what happens on those south slopes this time of year. We'll probably see a couple more of those yet. And another. Holy. This is so fun. <laughs> oh, oh, I got it on video! I don't want that on video! <laughs> hey, I thought you liked ice. Uh, not ice cold. <laughs> oh, yeah. I made it! Hey, hey, hey. 